guys. I wanted to do a video for you today to show you how to add a subdomain in GoDaddy. The platform has changed just very recently, so to add a subdomain is a little bit different, and so that's why since I had to change mine tonight and I had to finally call GoDaddy support and they explained that like, well, it's so new. I even have to look it up. The gentleman that, that you know, in support that was helping me. So, um, because it's a new platform, I figured I'd do this video for you guys. So if anybody wants to change their subdomain, they'll know how to do it. Log into your account and you click on my account you go down to domains and you launch the domain and you pick the domain you'd like to change just for demonstration purposes. And then you get to this next page. All right. That's the page that looks different. This used to look completely different. And now you would go to, you see you're on settings. You're going to click on DNS zone file. Then this page comes up. Then you're going to go to edit. See here right underneath where it says zone file, you're going to click edit. You're going to click here and you're going to click quick add. All right. I'm just going to type in Wendy's and then you just type in because this is, um, where it's pointing to through GoDaddy. Type in this IP address and then see right over here to the right. All you're going to do is click save zone file and it just says confirm. You're about to modify your existing zone file. Are you sure you want to save the changes? Okay. And that's it. Real simple. You know, it'll take effect. They always say, you know, in a few hours, but it could be as much as tw uh, 24 to 48 hours. And there you have it. That's how you add a subdomain now in GoDaddy. Talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.